everyone. Welcome to Cosmic Tarot. I am Sophia and I am your tarot reader. I should have done this before, but I really sense that now is the right time for me to introduce myself to you. You see, I understand and no one can deny that we are visual creatures. So I do not want you to create a false image of me. It is not fair. It is not fair to me and it's not fair to you. So, <laughs> hello. <laughs> For those of you that are interested in a private reading, all the information you need is down there below. Now, let's move on to your reading. Hello Sagittarius and welcome to my channel. This reading is for those of you that have strongly Sagittarius in your chart, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for May 2018. Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for May 2018. More shuffles. Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for May 2018. One more. Yes, and we're done. Okay, let's see. Okay, Sagis. On the bottom of the deck, you have the Three of Swords. You're hurt, but you will be fine. You will be fine. Don't become bitter, become better, Sagittarius. This was a lesson, okay? Now, let's see your cards. Let's see. First card for you, the moon. The Prince of Cups. Chariot. Ten of Cups. Nine of Wands. Four of Pentacles. King of Wands. The Fool. Very good. Very good. The Hierophant. And the Queen of Wands. Okay, okay. Now, Sajis, you have been hurt because you gave a lot and you got nothing in return. Let's go down. This person that you were dealing with, Sajis, was hiding something from you. They were keeping their distance. They were not fully engaged in this relationship because of this secret. And 
you knew, you felt that something was wrong and you could not point it out and this is why you were trying you were trying to bring this person close to you and make them, help them open up, but you were doing this with no result. And this was your pain. Now, of course, this is a general reading. It can go the other way around, okay? But I will not repeat that all the time throughout the video. You will get your messages, okay? If it doesn't resonate this way, turn it around, okay? Now, what I like here is that I see you moving forward. You are taking a leap of faith. You do not know where you're going, but you know that where you're going is much better from where you were. You want and desire love, true love and happiness in your life, no matter what. If this and if this person is not willing to give you the Ten of Cups, then you will say bye bye and you will move forward and this is what you're doing. And even though you were hurt many times in your life from this person, but I also sense here that you have been struggling in relationships so you have been hurt from other other people too okay but still here with the nine of wands you have power left within you to step forward in your new life in your new beginning you ready now you're ready. You are starting to feel again lovable, desirable. You are in the beginning of getting your power back. Now, for others of you, I'm hearing that, and this, this is for those of you that are coupled, you are together for quite some time, okay? And finally, this person or you made the choice to take this relationship, to move this relationship one step forward. You are ready to fully commit to this person. Now, let's see. Okay. This person that you're dealing for quite some time is waiting for you. It, this person is waiting for your answer. This person is desiring for you and them to move together, together. In abundance. Somewhere along the way, You've lost it. It's like everything was going fine. And then somewhere there in the middle, you only had memories. It was like nothing was going, 
that nothing was moving. You were stuck. And they only had their memories to make them feel happy. And this also applies for those of you that are married. Princess of Swords. Princess of Cups. And the Ten of Pentacles. Yes. Yes. Messages of love. Messages of stability. Of commitment. Proposals. Your wish is coming true, Sagittarius. Or you are going to make someone really, really happy. King of Cups, Queen of Swords, Prince of Pentacles, Two of Cups. Now, I see here that one of you has turned into the Queen of Swords, detached. And you or the other person are looking at this Queen of Wands with compassion, I see here. Look. And you're like, I'm hearing, I love you, I want you. Please forgive me for bringing pain I do not want you to feel any more pain. I'm sorry. This is what I'm hearing. They know that they are the ones that make you turn to the Queen of Swords and they do not like what they see. They want you back. They want the person that they fell in love with. Well, they have to do something about it, right? If they want you to shift your energy and, and become again the Queen of Wands. Yeah. They have to take action. Words are not enough. The world, Ace of Wands, and the Eight of Swords. Mm -hmm. Yes. This is coming to a completion. The cycle is closing. The cycle of stubbornness, because I do feel here there is, someone is very stubborn. You or this other person has Will not, is, is not willing to cross their boundaries. Because if they do so, they will feel that they betray themselves. So, Sagis, someone is taking action. You see here, both of you have your back turned, right? So, one of you will take the action, turn around, and grab the other person and embrace them and ask for forgiveness 
Yes. And then you will have your new beginning with the Ace of Wands. Now, let's see what message will come through for you in love. May 2018, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. For love in May 2018. This is your card. Treasure your loved ones. It is important to love others deeply. Well, you have to show your love or this other person has to show their love. They have to show that they care deeply for you. Words are not enough. Actions speak louder than words. Now, okay, Sagis, let's see your lesson for me. What is the lesson for Sagis in May 2018? This is your lesson. Live in the moment. Okay. On this day, strive to live in the moment. Only speak about positive things in your life and avoid bringing up the past. Especially negative memories or situations. Your goal, to experience how difficult it is to live in the present. Healing is rapidly en enhanced when you're focused in the now. So I'm getting here that you have to forgive them, forget the past, but you have to do this in order for you to have the Ace of Wands. Forget the past, okay? Live in the moment. Forgive. Show compassion. This is what I'm getting for you, Sagis. If this reading did not resonate with you, you can also watch your rising, your moon, and your Venus. Until next time. Bye-bye.